All right, welcome back everybody to some more Evil West. We're picking up where we last left off, and I believe we dropped our doff, our doff, our dad off at the uh, uh, doctor. So, uh, as always, if you're enjoying the content, leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe. But let's get into it. All right. Need to check on my gauntlet first. Yeah, we there do. Must be a workshop somewhere around. We gotta pick this up first. Oh, you everything, Doctor. Oh. That looked like the, uh... I can't remember what he is. What he does. I guess a scientist. I don't know. Whatever he is. Alright, let's head downhill. Mr. Rentier. What? Mr. Harrow wants to see you as soon as you're done in the workshop. Okay. I gotta be nosy first. Oh! There's a dead one. Oh, money! We got an electric chair. In case someone gets a little unruly. Alright. What's Jesus, going on in here? What a fucking dump. Did you see the size of that cockroach? Should have taken this meeting in the airship. You mean the one that blew up? Retard. What's up here? I'm trying to find all the little things. That I was looking back at my stuff. And apparently, I missed a couple. Where they're at? I don't know. These were just new devices in the workshop to resist, room, yeah, reset, yeah, and reassign all perks. Okay. Oh, there we go. Uh, Virgil Olney, engineer, born 1873, graduated from RI Science, training 1888, official member of RI since 1888. Virgil uh, Olney was discovered as an infant in the lair of a Chinese necromancer, having barely survived some of the arcane ritual brought back in Calico, Calico to research what was done to him. He, his discovery took some time, but the young man provided sharp as attack. Proved sharp as attack. He had a real talent for science and technology and eventually graduated first in his class. Good for him. What's this do? Would you like to reset all your weapons? No. What the hell do I want to do that? Mr. Rentier. What? Glad to see you, sir. The manor guys are in the house. Okay. No wonder Virgil's working overtime. You have no fear, sir. He keeps our equipment running like clockwork. Shut up. He may not look the part, eh? But he's a regular boy wonder. Sounds like an idiot. They think he is the heir to the fucking. When I got your goddamn gilded invitation, I expected champagne and canapes. Instead, some fang fuck broke into your headquarters and slapped you all around like a gaggle of whimpering sissies. Now the entire country is left unprotected while I stand here with my dick in my hand like an idiot. So again, could someone please tell me how the fuck did this happen? Security oh. services were redirected to protect our most valuable asset. And how the fuck wasn't that me? That was my father's call, and it was Agent Gravener's quick thinking that saved your life, sir. For all the fucking good it'll do once I tell the Capitol that its primary defense against all kinds of monsters just collapsed. We'll take care of it, sir. What, from here? This place is a shithole at the edge of fucking nowhere. And don't be fooled by our humble trappings, Secretary Harrow. Calico Cell has the highest survival rate in the Institute as well as its very best engineer. We are your only chance of turning this around. Then I expect a report on those tick assholes on my desk first thing, Doctor. And who the fuck are you? I, uh, uh, um... He's dicks. 
How are you? I'm the best engineer? You yes. better be. Because we need this thing operational as soon as possible. Before Harrow comes back to string us all up. Harrow can suck my... How bad is it? Well, the glamour disruptor's fried. Then we have the insulation around the power coupling. Can you fix it or not? It's doable, but I'll need time. A few weeks, a month tops. We ain't got that long. We have to be ready to take down this Felicity character when we find her. You mean if we find them? We have no idea where to even look. Not necessarily. To the north, there's a canyon surrounding the main trail. And the unimaginative locals call it the Devil's Pass. Now, reports mention possibly unknown vampiric specimens. We chalked it down to hearsay, but now we sent our top sanguisuge expert to investigate. I hope by expert you mean a field agent and not another bookworm. Scott Bloom co-wrote the Institute's sanguisuge best drink. We need soldiers, not pencil pushers. I can't run around looking for a missing egghead hoping that maybe he brings something to the table. When did he last report? Five days ago. Now let's just hope he's lost in research. All right. Stay there, horse. I'll walk it the rest of the way. I see money. And blood. Oh, oh. Mangled, mutilated, and ripped apart. Bloom, what did you walk into? Um, death. That's what it looks like. Okay. Oh. Holy shit. I didn't want to look in there anyway. You gotta leave that horse in there. Take that. More money? What's in there? How'd they see me? Shit. Stop shooting at me, fuckers. Shooting at me. Stop it. Oh, what's up there? Apparently, he don't come down. I always need more money. Costs a lot to live in the old west. You okay? Yeah, important documents. This species appears to possess shape shifting abilities. Shape shifting. So common for the typical sanguisuge. I dare say. Sanguisuge. I'm never going to remember that. Blood dependent, but it's hard to tell based on the limited amount of evidence found. I'm wondering if we're witnessing some sort of accelerated evolution, spurred perhaps by certain unknown environmental factors. That's an excellent question. Are you the doctor? Or the egghead or whatever? What's this? There we go. Left we go. Hey, you out in the sun. Where are those werewolves? I think those are werewolves. Yeah, 
show you. Oh shit! They hit you. There we go, got one. I powered! Look what we do! Yeah. People turning into beasts. Sucker. Something terribly wrong has happened in here. New lore. Oh, what we got? And Nagol. Nagol? Nagols? You gotta be careful with that word. Where once human beings cursed with a shape shifting affliction, seeking a cure, they pledged obedience to vampires when the bloodsuckers promised to help them remain in one true form. The form, however, turned out to be a bloodthirsty bestial soldier under the sway of its vampiric master. Naggals usually move in packs, and their howling can strengthen the resolve of others, their kind boosting their combat abilities. So don't let them howl. I mean, do that. Oh, I forgot about the ground. I, I forgot about the ground and pound thing. Gotta do that more. What was that? Oh. All right, we're not going that that away, nor that away. We go up. Can we go up here? No. Which way we go? Oh. There's something. Ooh, let's check this beauty out. Yes, sir. Say new perk. New perks? I like perks. What is this? Oh, well, the dash, the supercharge, the. Uh, can we buy that? We don't have enough for that. We don't have enough for that. What's this? We didn't get anything if we wanted to. Where the hell are we going? Oh, shit. I'm faster. I almost swear. I'm glad he knows where he's going. I have no clue. Uh oh. We're fine. Get the box ready. Get in place, assholes. Wait for my signal. Ready. Who are you? Some trace of blue. Blue! Oh, buddy. Where are you at, buddy? Homie. It's Jason Voorhees! Gotcha. 
Ow! Oh, like I finally died. Nice. Woo! Dropping a rock, Tommy. Here, out of here. What do we got now? Servant brute. Servant brutes are familiar with uh, familiars who partake in vampiric communion, communion, though not fully transformed to the, the gift of blood. Makes the brutes extraordinarily strong. Their massive muscles can repair and regenerate in a very short period of time. Ah. Just what I thought. Um, we go up there or through there? Let's check up here. <laughs> nah, good call, good call. All Under mine. 13 smackers. I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Protected like some kind of vault. What are they hiding here? I'll take it. Nice no question. Where's old? Old Lou. Find our old pal Lou still. Too far to jump. Hmm. Ah, we move that. Is the plan? Find an object that can. All right, we're gonna. Move. Just a little more. Beautiful. Let me jump up here. There we go. Cash. Cash. Money. Back down. No, oh, this is a nice little area. How was that? Something's in the ground. There we go. Money. Money. <laughs> Whatever it is, we're finding lots of dough. We're on hill. That's what she said.
Take that. And charge. Take that. Oh. Who are you high on that? Son of a bitch. Stupid thing. I get him. Christ, that was tough. So we'll to find Bloom in one piece. In case I missed anything, I look. No. Where are you? You fell. You better watch your step. You too. Very treacherous out here. Oh, there we go. What's this? Research continues, but nothing I've seen explains the unusual capabilities of this curious animal. Judging by the diameter of the tunnels it creates, I estimate it stands at least eight feet tall and is quite powerful. Eight feet. I don't think those werewolves were eight foot. Foot, feet, whatever. I found a door. That's what she that said. Bloom was looking for. Probably. Is that eight is that eight footer? Uh, those doors. Damn it. Is that it? Up there? Probably. Uh, use melee attacks on large enemies to fill the stack indicator located next to their health. Fully stacked enemies become susceptible towards being electrocuted with the zapper. Punch him. Punch, 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 punch. Oh shit. Me. And we punch, punch. Did that hit me? Your ass. Ow, that hurt. Gotcha. That's what we talked about. That's not fair. Reload! Reload! Gotcha. There we go. 
Reload. Miss me. I don't know what he's doing there. Didn't work. Did not work. doing it until you Woo. and then you and then we focus you Woo. Watch yourself. You got something to say? Do ya? Uh, no more. Nice. Did we get his head too? No. Oh, but there's money. Oh, we got a perk. We got a perk. Do we want to perk this guy? What's this? All pickups are now collectible from a much wider distance. I didn't know there were pickups. Uh, hold down while looking in midair enemy to smash them into the ground with an electric smasher. Uh, can an electrocuted enemy yields an energy pickup. Does not work in supercharged mode. And press one to destroy an incoming flying projectile attacks. Doesn't work with bullets or shockwaves. That could be useful. I think that would be useful. What's this? And let's get that because we want to decrease the amount of time it takes to. What do we got here? Um, for shotgun to recharge. It takes way too long for a shotgun to recharge, so we definitely want to reduce that. Is there anything over here? No. Okay. So one super vampire ass kicked. What's this? I find the flying creatures most disturbing. They appear in large numbers, protecting the newly transformed Sangrasuges like Sangrasuges guarding their hive. It's not clear if that's their only purpose. Perhaps they also gather sustenance and function as scouts. Maybe. Maybe. Jesus Christ, what, what the heck is that? Where the heck did it go? I don't know. That's the other side of the bridge. So I think that's the way we need to go. So I want to look over here. Real what quick. No. Oh, poor guy. What was that? 26. Oh, I need more money. Hitting a weak spot now restores a bullet. 
We have this performing the zapper pool or dash recharges the gauntlet. How much does this cost? All right, we got stuff we need to buy. So we need monies. Definitely need monies. We need to upgrade. Oh, I got what? New skin? What do you mean? Where's the new skin at? Is that what you mean? Okay. So our gun, our repeater rifle has a new skin, I guess. Uh-oh. These guys didn't fare too well. Yeah, looks like I'm getting closer to its nest. Why does it have a nest? That's what she said. A lot of dead things in here. Ugh, what a stench. This is no, she didn't say that. No, <laughs> Is that the eight footer? Gotcha. Uh. <laughs> oh, shit, and me, what are you? right off your head. Oh shit, he got me. I'm stuck on a wall or something. Where's big boy? Ah! Woohoo! Stop running away! Where are you? Guy's little friends. Oh, he's missing an arm. Oh, I got you. Christ, it's nothing like anything I've killed before. I know. What's it? we got, Lord? Ooh, a uh, go Gauro Gauro Gro. I don't know. Uh, this truly despicable creature has created a mass graves where the blood of the many mi mingle with the soil. Grow galbrews are born blind and for the first, what are they like, like moles? And for the first few weeks feast on the rotten flesh piled on the top of them as the blood soaks into the soil. The galro digs deeper in search of substance once below ground. The galro hides and... Darkness sheltering itself from the sun and the unsuspecting eyes of travelers. You'll feel the Garo before you see it. Just wait for the tremors. Copy. 10-4. Understand. 
Wait for the trimmers. No money. Who's this? Did, did we find him? Is this? Hello. Oh. Is anyone there? Hiding among the dead. Bloom? Is that you down there? Uh, yes, it's it's me. But who are? Whoa! You're Jesse Rennie, sir. Splendid. Rennie looks like Rentier. Care to explain what happened here, Bloom? Oh, oh. Uh, well, I was sent here to investigate reports of a novel breed of sanguisuge. But when I arrived, I encountered a group of familiars, apparently sent here by their masters. That was a familiar? How come a human turned into that thing so quickly? Well, excellent question, sir. My thesis is that their transformation is linked to the blood from these creatures somehow. The how is what I'm stuck on. Uh, we better take one of those things back with us to the lab still beats me what those familiars were doing here well, from what i could gather they were sent on a transport detail securing a convoy of carts filled with some curious wriggly little creatures they brought from mccallum sawmill no, we need to check that place out all right the bar Off to in such a hurry. Bar run out of whiskey? Jess, when we dragged your dad in here, there was an awful lot of blood on him. He'll be fine. There was. Bastard's too damn stubborn to die. I've seen my share of battle wounds. The ones William got, no way even half of that came out of him alone. Somewhere between the falling airships and hopping boo hags, I don't know. Could be that collateral damage wasn't the tick's only objective. Could be they... Uh... They infected him? No. No fucking way. Just hold your horses and just think about it. The Institute is infiltrated, and they let both you and William walk away? Jess, when a tick turns a familiar, they form a sort of bond. The sire can see into the servant's mind. Now, they make that link with, say... The man who developed that weapon you're carrying. Edgar, our orders are clear when folks get infected. Infected means dead. Those are his own words. Breathe. I've got an idea. Remember that crap I brought from Lake Mora Pass? Mm-hmm. That plant no, I don't. that was supposed to be a base for a cure one day. I'm not gonna gamble my father's life on some swamp nerd's magic potion. It's not like we got a handful of aces here, Jess. Dabano and his lunatic spawn had taken the fight to us. And I sure as hell don't want to go to war without our general. Do you? All right. The plant might be back in the manor's ruins. I'll go check if there's anything left of the lab, and you... I go. You need to take care of the gauntlet. I don't give a flying fuck about the gauntlet. I'm not sitting on my ass while my father grows a new set of teeth. And no one asks you to. But if I fail... You and that gauntlet will be the only thing between us and a war we can't win. I got this, okay? Just keep an eye on that nosy lady doctor. And stay close to William, just in case I don't make it back in time. Mm. Anything of interest in the bar before I go? Glad to see you in one piece, sir. Talk. Devil's Pass. Talk to people. Nice to see how it got its name. Talk to people. I'm stuck. Ah, I knew it. What we got? March 1866. The war between the states might be over, but the larger war. The secret war continues. Many men still suffering from the toll the war took on their spirits, souls, and bodies find themselves vulnerable to the Sanguizuja's vicious predations. Because of that, we must ramp up our efforts. Our scientific research team has been working on a device that might finally give us an edge in this fight. As part of this effort, I am officially promoting Agent Edgar Gravener to take my place in the field. I, of course, will continue on from the home office. Thank you all for your service, and may the good Lord watch over and protect us. 
Director William Rentier. Rentier. Yeah, what the hell did that guy call me? It wasn't Rentier. Like Rainier or something. Sir. What? I hate to see him like this. Oh, is so that my dad? Vulnerable. He's infected. 100%. 100%. He's infected. Girls, what you girls? New girl, I'm a. What are you all doing? I'm yeah. just glad you brought Bloom back in one piece. They're waiting for you in her lab. Okay. Ah, money. Good to see you back, sir. Shut Be up. Be careful there, Mr. Rentier, sir. The verge is... Oh, where is it? Where the hell did I put it? Get out! Get out! Down the fuck to do. It's you. But I mean, I'm terribly sorry. Do you have a moment, sir? The tragedy that Debano's head was taken. No, oh, don't care. We lost so much knowledge. That's what worries me. It's not something you can orchestrate overnight. We've been fighting each other. What's up? Since... Until recently, the Sanguisus reproduced by turning their familiars. A slow, but effective process. But now there's this new breed. <sighs> Popping up like rabbits. Mm. They're fierce and resourceful, but still not anything we can class as an evolutionary step up the ladder. Well, if anything, they're a step backwards, mindless and bloodthirsty. They're cannon fodder. This is Debano's idea of an army. Humans turn to minions or whatever foul blood beasts they'll end up being. Foul blood? Precisely, sir. Splendiferously observed. Splendiferously. Well, sure we have to investigate McCallum's sawmill? McCallum's won't be an easy nut to crack. Without a working gauntlet, we can't penetrate its glamours. Guess it's high time to check up on our resident genius. God, why do you I fix it yet? Pig. Paper, paper everywhere. I can't find shit in here. Oh, hi. Uh, holy moly, where are my notes? <clears throat> As we all know. Faraday's mutual induction phenomenon. Virgil, take it easy with the jargon, please. You're talking to a field agent. <sighs> Diamagnetism, polyphase system. Uh, you sure you don't want to hear my radiography joke about... Uh, never mind. Here it is. Long story short, I reverse engineered the disruptor mechanism and identified the problem. Its energy consumption is off the charts. Best engineer in the Institute, huh? Well, before you jump down his throat, perhaps we can give Virgil a chance to explain himself. Miniaturization has its limits. If you want a working disruptor like this, you have to accept the fact that it won't be, well, portable. Like Amelia so kindly pointed out, I'm a field agent, as in I go out in the field. If the gauntlet's not portable, it's useless. Now, I don't mean to put your ass over the fire, but... Apparently you do. But... If we don't get it running, we're all done for. Can you make it work? Well, maybe if I could somehow get my hands on some spare coils from the original disruptor... Done. Where can I find them? On a remote outpost. Reports about a visual anomaly in a mining town called Baxter. It turned out to be a glamour. Director Rentier sent me there to deliver a crate of heavy electrical coils. They were designed to help our engineers disrupt the illusion. Unfortunately, before the team could collect any relevant data, the cell was destroyed by the ticks. Whatever they were hiding must have been important. They left no one alive. How will I know these coils, Birch? Just look for a miniaturized electrical resonance. Okay, transport. okay, that's not gonna work. Pack your shit, kid. We're out in five. Could just drew you a picture. I'll go down first and clear the way. 
Try not to get killed or Blackwell skin me alive. R Roger that, Mr. Jesse. All right, we are going to end this episode right here. Uh, as always, I hope you guys are enjoying uh, uh, Evil West. I'm still liking it. It's pretty fun, you know, for a, a matching game. So um, if you if you are liking what you see, as always, leave a leave a like, leave a comment, let me know what you think, and subscribe. But until next time, check you later. Peace.